Hi guys, welcome to another video. So I've got some exciting news to share with all of you today. Uh, first and foremost, I want to thank each and every one of you for being a part of this amazing community. Uh, your support means a lot to me and uh, it's because of all of you uh, that we are able to make this next step. Uh, so I've been thinking about the future of this channel and I decided to make some substantial changes. Uh, these changes are designed to make this channel more appealing and set a clear path for the future of this channel. And I'm not just sharing this with you, I want you to be part of this conversation, so share your thoughts and suggestions in the comments. And uh, of course I will read it and uh, maybe use some of your advices. Uh, but first uh, let's take a look at some statistics, so you understand why I am making these changes and what is the goal. So right now we are uh, in the YouTube analysis and as you can see uh, here we have some view statistics. This is from the beginning of this channel. I have it auto translated to English so you can understand it a little bit better. The main thing here is that you can see when we started, it was of course uh, really low, but then we had the most views when in World of Warcraft. There was the end of the expansion Shadowlands and beginning of Dragonflight uh, yeah, around uh, 2022. So this is where we had the most views and uh, since then it just went down a little bit. I started making Armies of Exio content, which is of course higher quality than those World of Warcraft videos, but it takes much more time and the community is just smaller because it is a really old game. So overall it went a little bit down and I decided to make some substantial changes for this channel, which I will share with you today. Now you may be asking what all is going to change. First the most important thing is the content. Uh, this channel started as a channel where I uploaded uh, gameplay of World of Warcraft Arena games and at the time I started I really enjoyed World of Warcraft and played it every day so it was no problem for me to record dozens of games a day. Anyway, as you probably can tell from the videos I'm releasing now from World of Warcraft, I don't play World of Warcraft anymore that much, uh, at least not actively, so I only release low level Arena gameplay videos because I just don't have any relevant gear on my max level characters. And at the same time I have to force myself to make those videos and since I started this channel as something for fun I want this video making process to be fun as well for me. Uh, so I decided to stop releasing uh, World of Warcraft videos for a while now. I'll probably come back to them at some point in the future when I'm enjoying World of Warcraft again. Maybe it will be in with the next expansion, maybe sometimes later, but for now I'm taking a break from it. Uh, I realized that most of my viewers came to this channel way before I started releasing any other content than World of Warcraft and maybe this is a move that will make me lose most of those viewers but I still want to thank you for being with me all that time of course. Uh, you may also notice that I've started releasing some gameplay videos from Heroes of the Storm. Uh, these are more like a filler videos uh, without any commentary or editing. Uh, I still play Heroes of the Storm so it's not uh, as much of a problem for me to upload these videos as it is for World of Warcraft, however they don't have too many views yet so I will leave that up to you. If there is a proper interest in the comments for Heroes of the Storm gameplay videos I may continue them or try another format with them, otherwise I will probably stop uh, with these videos as well. And finally we come to the most important thing uh, which is Armies of Exigo, a game I love and I know that the viewers who come to my channel because of this game love it too. Uh, you guys are the ones building the strongest community that motivates me to create more content for this great game. So of course I won't stop with that, even though I don't have much free time right now. I'm still working on new projects and trying to come up with new content around Armies of Exigo. And uh, I already have another project ready for you and the trailer will be revealed in the next video on this channel. I can already tell you that it will be something unique and amazing once again. At the same time I'm already working on another project and uh, I have ideas for more videos about Armies of Exigo. Uh, however Armies of Exigo is of course not bottomless, therefore I would like to look into other older RTS games like Knights and Merchants and Warcraft 3 in the future. Of course I won't stop Armies of Exigo videos completely but I will just add some more similar content to it over time and I would definitely like to make tutorials for editors in these games that I mentioned, similar to what I did for Armies of Exigo, because I know that uh, it is something people can uh, really use and uh, there just isn't enough good editor tutorials on YouTube. Uh, however, these decisions also probably mean that videos will not come out as often, 
up until now I've been releasing videos every even day of the month, uh, so mostly every other day. However, half of these videos were just World of Warcraft or Heroes of the Storm gameplay videos, which obviously don't take as much time as uh, Armies of Exigo videos to make. So for now, the videos will be coming out probably once every four days. So when I add the other RTS games, as I mentioned in the future, I will decide how we proceed. Other changes on my channel will include uh, changes to the YouTube banner and profile avatar, which I will include a few hours after I upload this video, so you have some time to adjust and it's easier for you to find this video. And I would also like to focus on video thumbnails, because so far I've been using only frames from the video, which isn't very good for the algorithm, so I would like to try some more interesting thumbnails using AI. At the same time, I will also probably modify the video titles to work better, with the algorithm as well, and maybe I will even remove the outro from my videos since most people probably skip that anyway. I thought a lot about these changes, but ultimately this channel is for all of us, so feedback is really valuable for me, so let me know uh, what you love, what you think we could do better, and let's make this channel a better place together. So that's what's happening here on the channel, the next chapter is here, I'm happy to have all of you with me on this journey, and thank you for ongoing support, I can't wait uh, to continue creating content that I will love, and you also will love it, and take care guys.